Hey, good morning, you guys, and happy Saturday. I just want to talk briefly about having low self-esteem. Now, this conversation can go a lot of different ways, so I'm just going to touch on what I've actually seen with my own two eyes. Now, um, ladies, if you're in a relationship with a man, and you know for a fact that he is cheating on you with another woman, do not change up your entire image to look just like that woman. Don't change your hair just like hers. Do not start wearing the clothes that she wears or how she wears them. It's going to be totally obvious as to what you're actually doing. First of all, if it's to the point where you know he's cheating, leave him. But if you're not strong enough or at that point to where you can walk away, then if you want to change your look, that's fine. But don't do it in a way to where it's going to be like that woman. Make sure the clothes are going to be clothes that you're going to be comfortable with wearing. Make sure those hairstyles are going to be hairstyles that you're going to be comfortable, you know, with rocking, you know, whatever. And um, just make sure the entire image or the look that you're going for is going to be, you know, attractive. Since you think that he's attractive to that particular type of woman. But make sure that you're still going to be comfortable within your own skin. Because... The more you try to be like her, what's going to happen is you're going to continue to have even more low self-esteem because you're going to forever be in competition with that particular type of woman that it is that you think that he's actually attracted to. So I just want to encourage you all on today to just love yourselves. Love the skin that you're in. Look in the mirror every day and tell yourself how beautiful you are, how attractive you are. Um, tell yourself that you deserve better. I don't care if you have to keep repeating those things um, several times a day. Whatever it is that's going to make you feel good about yourself, you need to do it. Because the last thing that we need to do is to seek validation from a man. Yeah, we want to make our man happy, but don't try to make the wrong man happy, especially if he's seeking, you know, the attention of another woman or, you know, he's out here giving attention to another woman. Um